Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another fantastic episode of Pokemon Emerald Randomized. And in the last episode, we entered Mobville City and we fought our rival. And in this episode, we are going to fight the third gym leader. Um, if you're wondering why I'm waiting in the PCs, because I just wanted to show you something very epic. While I was grinding, I happened to find a Flareon, level 13, with crappy moves. A Latios, level 14, with crappy moves. An Espeon, level 6, with crappy moves. And a Dragoneer, with decent moves, level 13. If you're wondering why I named him Lai, it's actually pronounced Lee, not Lai. I know this is the same way I'm spelling Lai, but... My friend's last name, it's spelled like this and it's pronounced Lee, so that's why I ended up putting it like this. Desire is because that's the only name that popped in my head when I named him. When when I saw his tail, I was like, he's going to be called Taily. And I don't know why I named you Edge with all capitals. Um, I Maybe I was just bored. I, I, I am really bad with nicknames. You could probably tell. Oh, I completely forgot. You should talk to, not this bookcase. You should talk to this dude right here. And you can get, like, basically some random thing. Let's just go with the doll. We do you want it? Yay, wait a second. You don't have any per any piece of decoration. Haha. -ha. But yes, if you do have, like, decoration and blah, blah, you can get that stuff and whatever. That's, like, something else. Blah, blah, blah. No! Ah! I forgot to sign out of Steam again. Uh, and we got another message. Um, I will quickly hold on one second. And we are back. I am completely sorry I could did a blah to Steam. I always forget. I know, I'm so bad. Anyways, we are going to do complete double battles to make this go by faster. But before we do those double battles, I just want to show you. Rocky, 21. Blaze, 22. Sharon, 21. Agruff, 21. Fishy, 21. Ducky, 21. Fishy 22, Ducky 21, 2 level 22s, and 4 level 21s. And we are going to start off with an epic double battle. Yeah! With my charm and my Pokemon's move, you'll be shocked. Ah, that's kind of a pun. My electric soul, it'll shatter your dreams whole. Wahaha! Wait, whoa, yeah, ha. That's more like it. Hee hee! Ah, my voice is cracked! <laughs> and we are going to fight a guitarist as well as some fighting trainer fighter thing. So, what are we going to do, you ask? We are going to roll out. We are going to fire punch. Hopefully, this is not similar to my pre-run, which, which was actually very lucky against the gym leader. I got a magnitude 10 against, like, basically all of his Pokemon and I was just like holy chis noodles but against these trainers the stupid electric I kept on getting paralyzed on just like that and I'm mad again don't worry it's okay fire punch can destroy everything in one hit look at that one hit KO hopefully I don't get paralyzed because when I was doing the pre-run against these dudes I kept on getting paralyzed watch just like that. Rocky is paralyzed and cannot move. Just like that. Stupid piece of son of a gun. Gosh, that annoys me like crazy. And watch him get paralyzed too now. Yeah, and he's paralyzed too. Just like the pre-run. But I did get a level up. I don't remember. I think it was on this guy right here. I got the level up. And I'm too paralyzed to move, of course. If this, If I keep getting paralyzed, I'm just going to... Cut this stupid little part, Digimon, Pokemon, whatever the hell this is, out. Yes, we didn't get paralyzed, and I'm confusing my Digimon and Pokemon again. Okay, unfortunately, I have to go to the Pokemon Center already and heal. So, I will meet you guys momentarily. I, right now. Didn't I say momentarily? I'm probably not in the same place. I think I was up here. But it doesn't matter. Let's continue. With this epic trainer, epic double battle. I love shiny things. Maybe as a shiny Pokemon. I trained under Watson. There ain't no way I'll lose easily. This guy's pretty gangsta. He's a gangster, man. He's like, yo, yo, yo. I got a banana phone. What are you going to do about it? 
And I'm just like, chill. Chill with that banana phone, yo. Chillax with that banana phone. And what are we going to do, you ask? We are going to roll out this flying bird thing and we are going to fire punch this, um, circly Voltorb thingy. And the reason I did that is for two reasons. One, uh, Voltorb has Sonic Boom. And two, because, um, this guy also has a Magnemite as its second Pokemon. And, uh, fire is super effective against that. Ow, that didn't kill it. Wow, that was whack. But my pre roam was even worse, though. Like, you don't even want to know what the pre roam was like. I don't even know why I'm telling you about it. Uh, it was just horrible. Ah, there we go. There's a level up. Blaze is gonna level up too sometime. Oh no, Shockwave. Ouch! He didn't use Shockwave in the pre run. That's weird. Good. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. I kept on missing in the pre run. It was very bad. Blaze had to do, like, basically all the work. It was horrible. It really was horrible. I'm not even like kidding. And this is it. This is when everyone just gets murdered. Right here, right now, right there. And Blaze is gonna get a level up too. Right now. Da ding See? I know. I know the future. I am awesome. And we get some epic money. Now let's fight the single trainer, and then we will magically enter Watson's lair. Well, this is this whole gym is his lair, technically. Zigzagoon! I don't know why I just said it like that. Oh, yes! Uh, if you haven't already noticed, I do have self-destruct, which is going to be very useful, possibly. Magnemite 6, this is not going to kill him in one hit. Unless I get a critical. That's very unfortunate, though. Wow, that did a lot of damage. Yeah, let's do another Magnemite. Magnitude, I don't know why I just said Magnemite. I think I said Magnemite the first time too. Man, I'm getting all my names mixed up. And he has a Gulpin. Gulpin. Uh, what's that? Oh, I think it's in Super Smash Bros where there's a Gulpin. And Gulpin like eat you alive if you like get him as a Pokeball. Uh, my friend always used to do use that against me. Like he would always get the Gulpin. And it would just annoy the bunkles out of me. It, it, for some reason, it would always, like, magically swallow me even if I was 5 million kajillion feet away. And it sucked. But it, it was awesome. Like, I love Gulpin. Anyways, that is the last youngster in this. Well, the only youngster. But I will heal up and meet you momentarily in front of Watson. We are now in front of Watson. Let's talk to him. I've given up my plans to convert the city I have, and so I put my I put my time into making door traps door traps in my gym. Okay. Oh, now what are you doing here? What's that? You say you've gotten past my rigged doors? Wah ha ha! Now that is amusing. I then I Watson, the leader of Mavia Gym, shall electrify you. Yay, we're going to get electrified. But don't worry. Don't worry. Actually, I don't think you can hit us with electric attacks. I am uh, Rocky. Rock. Rocky. Rock. I am part ground and... He has rollout? That's very strange move to have on a Voltorb. Oh, this is a 1 KO. Oh, I feel bad for this Voltorb. Oh, God. He's just going to get destroyed. Um, he has a Magnemite as well. It's a very simple battle. Um, if you have, if you have a rock type like me, I mean, if you guys are playing without the randomizer, it might be a little more difficult. But be careful, make sure you do not fight him with physical attack because you could get paralyzed like I did before. Um, uh, but since Magnemite is special, but in this game it is considered a physical attack because it's ground and whatnot unfortunately he's gonna use a super potion yes this is like quote unquote a let's play curse which I don't know a lot of people say there's like a let's play curse when you play you get like very unlucky and I think I think that's possibly true when you're recording something you definitely do get unlucky definitely oh he has a magneton 
And he used a Super Sonic, which really sucks. But um, when I did the pre, oops, I just like punched my mic. When I did the pre-run, I did get hit the first. No, I did not get hit the first time. No, I actually snapped out of confusion on my first try. Hopefully, I get a six. I don't think that's gonna kill it in one hit. I think a seven or higher. Oh, six did kill it in one hit. Ah, that's good for me. Hopefully, I don't stay confused. But fortunately, we killed the Sonic Boom dude, so his Manek trick can't really hurt me except with a quick attack, but that's gonna do what? One damage, two damage at most? Unless he gets a critical, obviously. Oh, he's gonna howl. He's howling up. He's howling up. Howl. Magnitude 8. Oh, this is most likely gonna kill it. I'm actually getting kind of lucky in this gym. Did it kill it? Yup. That's it. What an easy gym. You guys probably are like ha ha wait why why would you be laughing at me when i owned him Whoa, ha, ha, ha. fine i lost you uh, you ended up giving me a thrill take this badge yes he's laughing he's laughing at his failure we got the dynamo badge from watson the dynamo badge pokemon can use rocks met out of battle and it will make your Pokemon a little bit faster, too. Hmm, you should take this, too. Um, I did say my next Pokemon game will be a Nuzlocke, but Nuzlocke's are kind of overrated. I've seen on the internet, they're very overrated. So, when I do start my next Pokemon game, um, which I don't know if I told you guys yet, but if I when I do start it, um, I'll give you, I'll put, like, a video before I start it. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do, and then I'll, if, I'll give you like a week. I'll give you guys like a week to decide whether I should do a Nuzlocke or a regular. But yes, that is the end of this episode. Thanks for watching, guys. And in the next episode, we are gonna go north of whatever the city's called, Mavville or Mav, what something with an M. We're gonna go north of it, and we're gonna use Rock Smash, and we're gonna go fight some awesome Team Magma slash Aqua members. Until next time. Keep on fishing.